Hello, everyone. In this episode, you will learn how to create a non-playable character NPC with AI Assembler. This NPC has the capability to engage in interactions with the player, similar to the AI-generated characters in our game, AI Asylum. Since this is a very important new feature, we are going to create a series for you to watch. First of all, make sure that you have the latest version of Yahaha Studio 0.3.66 or later. Before you start creating an interactive AI NPC with an assembler, note that you have two options, using a preset AI NPC or choosing Create by Myself, which allows you to use your own NPC model and leverage key features of your custom AI Asylum character by providing its ID. So, let's try the preset official AI NPC first. Select an AI NPC from the available options. These options are smart assets, complete with predefined character backstories and favor score systems that represent the NPC's contentment level. To find more, go to Collections by Yahaha AI Game Jam AI NPC Smart Assets in the Asset Library. For example, we choose Mio as the AI NPC. If you choose to create from scratch, you can look for an NPC model in the Character Model folder of the AI Game Jam. For the character ID, it is exclusive to a game character you created and published in AI Asylum. By attaching it to your NPC, the NPC inherits a character backstory and the favor score system. To find the character ID, click plus write your own stories in the game to access the modding interface, then locate the character in My Patience. Please note that you can select Use GPT 3.5 for your AI NPC and enter your OpenAI API key in the following input field if you are using GPT 3.5 optionally. In the Configure the AI Trigger Event list, you can click the plus button to add a trigger event and provide a name for the triggered event if needed. When using your own model, this step is necessary as it enables your NPC to listen to, customize, and send trigger events and become interactive with other objects in the scene. You can select one of the following events as a trigger. Emotion 1 to 10 represents the AI NPC's favor score, ranging from 10% to 100%. It reflects the NPC's contentment level, with 10 being the least content and 100 being the most content. Chat win indicates that the player wins the chat interaction with the AI NPC, while chat lose indicates the opposite. Let's click assemble to initiate the setup process for this AI NPC. Once the NPC is assembled, you will be able to modify its properties in the Properties window. In addition, to facilitate future management, you can change the AI NPC's name from Mianyang variant to Mio in the Objects Explorer. Now, you may ask, how to edit it? In the Properties window, a series of components are combined to assemble the AI NPC. All mentioned components can be found via Plus Feature or the Asset Library. For example, by going to Plus Featured Gameplay, you can find and add the NPC feature with the following properties. And in the Asset Library, go to Collections by Yahaha AI Game Jam AI Components for AI NPC, where you will locate all related AI components used in this Create an AI NPC Assembler. Please keep in mind that if you attach multiple assemblers to the AI NPC you created, all assemblers connected to the same trigger will be executed simultaneously. Now it's time to play test your AI NPC in play mode. Isn't she amazing? That's all for today. In the next episode, we'll learn how to add an audio event to the AI NPC. See you there!